Here's the people you, that you personally sponsor. Let's say you started, you're putting everybody in. Everybody needs to run a contest. The very first contest that you run within your organization is for your three spots. Because you only need three legs. So you run it for your three spots. We give you a real life example. We'll start with me. When I launched out on February 15th, I put 12 people in the first day. I pulled all 12 of them together and I said, I love all of you equally. So it's not up to me who's going to be the three. It's up to you. And they said, well, I said, oh, no, 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 no. Whoever builds the biggest business, this was on February 15th, whoever builds the biggest business between now and March 15th, I give them 30 days. Remember, I'm in a 45-day run, so make a mental note of what we're doing here. 45-day run, I give them till March 15th, so 30 days. Whoever builds the biggest business by March 15th, the three of you become my top three positions. Everything that I've done to this point and will do for the rest of my career will happen underneath one of you three. Think about this. What I created was a feeding frenzy. Because all 12 of those folks knew that without a shadow of a doubt that I was going to build this business. There was no question whether I was going to build this business. They had no question at all. The only question they had is what they had to do to get to the top of those legs. So I created a feeding frenzy. We broke three ambassadors before the deadline. So it, they identified themselves. They identified themselves by three legs. Make sense? Everybody else that we had in our waiting room, we were on the 15th of the month. We had all the way till the end of the month before the month closed. So then what you do is you take everybody else and you contest everybody else out. And I'm going to give you all some philosophy on this so you all understand this. These folks here, here was my three. I took these folks here, these folks here, and I ran a contest underneath these three. Not for these three, for those three's team. Whoever does X, Y, Z gets the placement of this group, not a person. Because remember, they've been in the waiting room for 30 days building. By the time I place them, they've been in the waiting room for 45 days building. Folks, I placed presidential directors. Presidentials. They done 80,000 in volume. I was placing presidentials down in the organization for people that won the contest. The same thing's happening here. Y'all seeing this? Everything you do needs to be done through a contest. Never stack. Never promise out a position. We tell you what don't do. Don't tell somebody, if you come in, I'll put you at the top of my leg. Right. Why would you do that? They're going to come in and lay down, and you're told them you're going to put them at the top of your leg. Why? Do, where's their interest? Where's their value in doing anything? Here's what you tell them. You come in and do X, Y, Z, and I'll put you at the top of the leg, or I'll put you in a particular position. But you make them do it first, then you make the placement second. If you don't, then you can just go build any business and don't have a waiting room. You're not using the advantage of the waiting room. The waiting room, you've got all these people, you've got up to 60 days to determine where they need to go in your business. You know what this does? This separates the talkers from the doer. How many of y'all got some folks that tell you they're going to do everything and never do nothing? How many of y'all got them ones that don't say nothing and they just go do it, right? They're all in the waiting room. Who cares what their mouth is saying? What volume are they generating? I'm not going to get into all the details with Rick's, Rick, there's multiple groups in here, with Rick's team from Rick down. We'll begin place, we'll begin, um, the contest will end on August 15th for the three, for Rick's three positions and then the people's under him, same thing. Everybody does that for the three positions. On the 15th through the 20th, we'll begin rolling out contests for the waiting rooms of the people that'll be expiring that month for placement down underneath them. Make sense? Yeah. For those of you who are just now launching, it'll be the same thing just a month later. Okay? 60 days to determine where to place it. Always contest, always contest. Never stack, always leverage. Never stack, always leverage. Stacking means you're just putting them Bang, 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 bang. You're just sticking them in there. You know, that's kind of the binary mentality. You stick them in there. You know, here's the philosophy. You stack them in a leg. Somebody at the bottom of the leg will catch fire. And then everybody above them will want to go build. How many of y'all know that's a lie? <laughs> everybody above them wants to sit there and look at them. 
<laughs> want to do nothing. There it is a very often that uh, that happens, that, that somebody actually blows it up at the bottom of the leg and then everybody above them takes off. That doesn't happen that often. So why would you build your whole business around that concept? Don't build it that way. Mm -hmm. Make them earn the placement. Everybody needs to earn placement. Make sense? Say yes? Yes. yes. <laughs> Man, we're way ahead of time. Let's talk, um, make sure I'm right. <laughs>